In this video, I'll show you how to send a push notification to a specific user profile. So a real case scenario would be someone is using your app to log in and then you want to send a specific message that is related to this user. Like your friend um, wrote something on your wall or sent you a, a message. We will achieve this with the alias method in Pushbots. So in Pushbots, there is an alias method that allows you to mark specific device with a specific name just to use it later so that you can be able to reach this specific user without the need to know its registration ID or token. In this case that would be like an email or a username. So for the sake of simplicity I've created this app just to show you how this by and large works. Of course this applies to Android as well as iOS uh, but I'm sticking to Android in this tutorial. So right here we have an app that asks for the user input for email and password. If I write John and John and click sign in, it gives me the message that it failed. And if I try John and demo and click sign in, it redirects me to another intent with hello John. We have two activities. The login activity, we basically we're just creating a button and then assigning a an on click listener to it. And on click, all we do is we get the value of email and password and compare it to John and demo. And if that is success, then we redirect the user to the next activity. And if not, we show a toast message. Of course, reward scenarios would require you to make a real request, a dynamic request, uh, to compare the user data. Uh, but just for the sake of simplicity, I'm making a very static condition here. And then the next activity has nothing uh, but hello plus the name uh, of the user that I'm passing uh, as an extra. So that's really pretty much what this is about you'll find a link in the description with the whole project on github let's start now by actually implementing push notification into this app so I'm gonna use the pushbots command line installer so I'm gonna start by typing pushbots install it's gonna ask me a few questions about my app ID which I have here then my app secret and then my GCM and then my GCM sender ID and that's it so let's uh, let's run this app and as we see this device registered so just to double check we can always go and type pushbots test and then we get the notification here that's half of the mission done now what we want to do is after the registration is successful we want to mark this device as John's device so I'm gonna use the pushbots shared instance dot set alias and I'm gonna call it John and let's just run it so now let's try typing John and demo and clicking sign in you would see here that alias response is 200 OK so right now this device is marked as John's to make sure let's go to pushbots I'm going to go to my dashboard. Here's my login demo with one device. So let's click on devices. You'll see here that this device is uh, has this alias, has this John alias. So let's try to use our backend to send a specific message to John. I'm going to be using the PHP uh, class but of course you can use the Node.js uh, or just the API directly through your command line. 
pretty straightforward. I'm defining my app ID, my app secret, and here I'm defining the alias as John, and I'm sending a test message for John on both platforms, and I'm pushing it. That's all what we need. So let's run this. And we have received this very specific message for John. No one else will get this message apart from John. Just to be sure, I'm gonna alter this alias to something else. And let's refresh. As you see, we haven't received anything because the alias is different. And this one, of course, doesn't exist, so we're not getting it here. But if we put it back to John, with another test for John we get the message this is probably the easiest way to get a notification sent to a specific profile or specific device stay tuned for more tutorials on pushbots.com